All right, y'all. So what we're working up to is an arc question. All right. And before that, we're going to have a sector question. But the key to all of this is just being able to go from area to circumference, which is pretty straightforward. You know that the area of a circle is pi r squared, 36 pi. We'll just take a second with this, cross out the pi's. r squared is 36. Screw it both sides. So r is 6, right? And if it's asking for the circumference, circumference is what? 2 pi r, so that would be 2 times pi times 6, that's 12 pi, so that's that. But now, let's get into something a little bit more tough, now that we know how do we move from area to circumference. So here, in circle C shown above, if CB is 8, okay, so this is 8, and just a quick note, whenever it says in circle C, that means that is the center of the circle. I had a lot of questions on that, okay? Measure of angle ABC is 45, so A... B, C is 45, so this angle is 45, right? And it's asking what's the area of the shaded region. Just a real quick note, okay? Whenever you're dealing with a shaded region like this, okay, like what we have up here, right? That is called a sector, obviously, all right? And just think of a sector as the slice of a pizza, okay? And the arc is part of the crust, so the sector is part of the area. So all we have to do here is figure out the area as a whole, right, which would be pi, Radius squared, 8 squared, that's 64 pi. That would be the whole area. We just need to know what portion of the circle we're dealing with, right? Well, we've got a triangle here, right? And in this triangle, this side and this side are equal, so that means this angle and this angle are equal. 45, 45, what? 45, 45, 90, right? Because those three would add up to 180 for the triangle. So we're dealing with what? 90 degrees out of 360 degrees, which simplifies to what? One fourth. So we're dealing with one fourth of this area, right? So it's the same thing as taking that full area, dividing by four, and we get 16 pi. I'm getting so excited because so many of you all are watching the videos. Like it's starting to spread. Share it with your friends because I really want to help a lot more people. So here we have this area of circle A above is 81 pi. So the area is 81 pi pi and we know pi r squared 81 pi get rid of the pi's square root both sides r is 9 so we know our radius is 9 now what is the length of arc bc so we want this arc here and remember arc is a portion of the crust right crust is circumference so circumference is 2 pi in this case the radius is 9 so it's 18 pi right and it tells us that angle a is 60 degrees, right? Well, 60 out of 360 simplifies to 1 sixth. So it's the same thing as taking this 18 pi, dividing it by 6, and we get 3 pi. That's it, y'all. That's it. We just worked through area, circumference, how to translate between them, and arc and sector. Definitely share the channel with people. Also, make sure to go to radoscom slash rd live i've got an awesome event coming up i'm teaching live prior to the august sat it's only about a week away and if you use the code rd fam 20 you get 20 dollars off and i'd love to see you all there i'm excited i'm gonna be teaching a live event and the live event comes with access to over a thousand videos and practice questions from my full program so you got to check it out i love y'all man peace